Welcome to InterviewHelp.io There are at a very high level the upcoming 9 steps that you will need to go through in order to effectively design a system. Step 1. Identify the type of question, typically there are 4 core types of system design questions. In an interview, you will essentially get a blend of them. They are algorithmic dense question, scale question, system architecture question, and product design. Step 2. Identify actors in the system. At a high level, an actor is essentially someone who uses the system, it could be a person or system. Step 3. Identify use cases and user journeys. Put yourself in the user feet to figure out the functional requirements. You are encouraged to make smart assumptions as you go through it. Step 4. Non-functional requirements. Non-functional requirements are usually scale and acceptable latencies of the user journeys. You don't need to be very accurate in terms of scale, however you should be accurate to the scale of 10. Step 5. Build high-level system design and verify functionality works. A high-level system design is to help build a high-level diagram that showcases the various APIs, services, database design and connectivity between these services to provide an easy-to-understand view of a complex system. Step 6. Build detailed system design. During this process, you will have to make various technical choices. These choices could be anywhere from choosing the right technology to choosing the right algorithm. Step 7. Find flaws in your design. Discuss the drawbacks in the system which you have designed. Step 8. Discuss about disaster recovery. Step 9. Discuss about monitoring, alerting and operational excellence.